This evening, we learned the teen who shot Ellen Zaban in her driveway took a plea deal, guilty to attempted murder. Forgiveness is not easy for most of us, but ask the woman who was shot in the face and the arm three times, and forgiveness is helping her heal. I believe that he understands what he did was wrong, but I don't think he has remorse. Ellen Zaban says she realized early on, no matter what happened to 15-year-old Jameer Clark, it changed nothing for her. It wouldn't get my physicality back. It wouldn't get. It wouldn't regenerate the nerves. It wouldn't bring my job back. February 6, 2017, she pulled into the driveway of her Southside Youngstown home and heard a tap on the window. Clark shot her in the face, arm, and shoulder. He was charged as an adult. Judge Scott Kirchbaum signed the plea agreement on January 18th, seven years in prison for attempted murder. For Zaban, it's been a long road, five surgeries between her eye and shoulder. For right now, there's going to be one more to try and, because um, the, first of all, the eyes aren't the same shape or the size anymore. She can't lift her left arm sideways or backwards. Probably about a year or so ago, um, even though very lucky, can't, you know, I, I really have nothing to complain about. Um, but I would look at pictures and, and I would say, I just, I don't look like me. She has doctor's appointments, plastic surgeon visits, orthopedic visits, twice a week physical therapy for her arm and shoulder, and therapy to help her get over the attack. I'm getting more feeling like this is who I'm supposed to be, that it's okay. So what got her through it? Kindness, friendship, community. Just humbled beyond belief at all of the, you know, at all of the messages that I got, the prayers, the contributions, the help. Um, I, I never expected it. Moving forward, she says she wants to find a way to turn what happened to her into something good. It has to mean something, you know. Not only that that I heal and that I can, you know, do a zipper at some point. <laughs> in the back, um, but that, you know, that I, I can pay it forward, I guess, um, for all of the help that I got to get me here. Ellen still lives in the same house. She says sometimes pulling into her driveway where it happened is hard. So I asked her if she wants to move. Her home was her grandparents' home. She has decades of memories there, and she says all the good memories with her family outweigh that one bad memory.